All right, guys, this is uh, Warfox 101 here. This is um, February the 6th and of 2010. Um, I wanted to document my um, completed uh, quad-core gaming computer because next week it will be torn apart and it will be an i7 gaming computer. Um, the case is a Thermaltake Armor Full Tower LCS. Come with a liquid cooling system. I got it at Tiger Direct. I believe I paid 245 bucks for the case. It's a great case. I love it. The only thing. I don't like is that it has a negative case pressure that draws in a lot of dirty air through the top right here. There's no filters up here and it just gets dirty in there. Uh, the filters in the front, they do a great job. One thing, if you guys are thinking about getting this case, one thing I hate about this case is in between the filters there's a gap and a lot of air goes through those <laughs> instead of the filter itself I hate cases that don't have good filtering that's just one of my things I guess by the way I just weighed the case and with everything in it it weighs exactly 59 pounds Alright guys, this is uh, my computer on the inside. I'll just give you a quick rundown on what what's all in it. I have the uh, a Diamond ATI Radeon HD 4870, uh, the 512 version. The motherboard is a um, ASUS P5QE P45 chipset motherboard. Um, the quad core is a Q9400, a stock, um, I believe is 2.66, and I got this one overclocked to 3.4 gigahertz. Uh, the RAM is the OCZ Reaper 1066 DDR2 dual channel. I got 4 gigs. I got 4 1 terabyte Seagate Barracudas, along with a, uh, just a regular old DVD. Burner. The PSQ is the OCZ Stealth 600 watt, and if you guys are looking for a great power supply, that one is a great one. It's whisper quiet, it's got good reviews, and it's done me well. I will be installing that in my <laughs> wife's HP. I'll be giving her my old uh, 4870 and possibly the quad core if my brother don't want it. Um, I ordered to replace the power supply. I ordered the uh, Ultra X4 series uh, 1050 watt um, totally modular power supply. Uh, I believe Ultra and Corsair are one of the best. In my opinion, they uh, share the number one spot with OCZ close behind. Um, the motherboard I'm replacing the P5QE with is the uh, ASUS P6X58D Premium. Replacing the quad core with the uh, Intel Q, um, Intel Core i7 920. The RAM I'm replacing with the uh, DDR3 triple channel 1600 MHz um, Crucial Ballistics Tracers Blue. And the uh, video card, I'm getting the, I've ordered the um, ASUS um, HD 5870. And they say it's 13 inches long. So, I've come close. I think I'll make it fit. i got to relocate the reservoir. Um... 
Um, I also ordered a Blu-ray burner to replace the DVD burner. If you noticed from, if you watched some of my last videos on my computer, you probably noticed I replaced the green tubing with this gray uh, coolant tubing, uh, simply because uh, that loop right there between the VRM blocks was uh, pinching shut with the uh, thermal tape uh, tubing. Uh, cool lance tubing, it bends a little bit better. I'll be taking all the heat sinks off the uh, P6X58 motherboard and putting my cool lance blocks on them. I ordered a uh, CHC125 for the south bridge. I'm going to be using the CHC122 uh, that I have here. Uh, along with the CPU 350 and the VRM blocks will fit uh, on the P6 X58D so I'll be using those and if I can I'm going to get the block for the 5870 I'm not sure yet I might and I think blocks for the RAM are unnecessary unless you're really overclocking them and I'm not going to overclock the uh, RAM I think it's plenty fast at 1600 megahertz there's the stock radiator I ordered a um, that one is the uh, dual 120 millimeter radiator I actually ordered I thought I ordered a Colance uh, dual 120 millimeter radiator but after look, checking it twice, I've noticed I ordered the 140 millimeter, so I'm gonna have to return that once it gets here. This is uh, February the sixth, and I will have all my parts in on February 15th. Hopefully, this coming Tuesday, I'll have most of it. If you guys order from Coolant, you notice that. Uh, Cool Lance takes a lot longer to get to get to you than the other parts. Tiger Direct is pretty good. Usually three days you got your parts. I've never ordered from the egg, but I'll see how long it's going to take them. So okay, guys, that's uh, it for now. Um, keep a watch out for my uh, upgrade video because I'll be doing a video on uh, my upgrade. Uh, putting it together and I'll do some unboxings of the CHC 125 water block and the Ultra X4 series 1050 watt PSU and uh, that's probably all I'm going to do on unboxings but but that's it for now keep a watch out for my videos thanks for watching